Welcome back to Basic Gear Review. Today, we're checking out the Microtubes X7 by Dark Glass Electronics. The Microtubes X series brings the studio method producers have been using for years to cover the whole bass distortion spectrum, from punchy, mild overdrive, to articulate high gain, to raw and gnarly fuzz and everything in between. You now have absolute control in constructing your vision of what the perfect bass distortion texture, definition, and size should have. Let's run down the controls. The Microtubes X7 comes equipped with six knobs. The high pass frequency controls the cutoff frequency to be distorted, ranging from 100 Hz for thicker, fuzzier saturation, or 1000 Hz for ultra sharp definition. High drive sets the amount of distortion for the high pass side. High level sets the output volume of the distorted high pass signal. <laughs> Low pass frequency controls the cutoff frequency to be mixed back to the high pass side, ranging from 50 Hz for only sub bass and 500 Hz to preserve some clean mids. Low comp sets the amount of compression for the low pass signal. Low level sets the output volume of the low pass signal.
The Microtubes X7 has five sliders, giving you plus or minus 12 dB at 80 Hz, 500 Hz, 1 kHz, and 5 kHz. The master slider sets the overall volume of the unit. The Microtube X7 comes equipped with a balanced direct out with ground lift as well as a parallel out to send your clean signal to another amp.
To learn more about the Microtubes X series, click the link in the description below. As always, if you like this video and want to see more bass demos, subscribe to our channel. You can also head over to Patreon to get access to exclusive content and gear giveaways. Until next time, I'm Will with Basic Gear Review, and thanks for watching.